Let's do some laundry. Hey guys, uh, welcome back to our channel. If you are new here, please feel free to subscribe um, and hit that notification bell so that you see whatever we upload. Today, I'm gonna be tackling this huge tote of dirty laundry and kind of explaining how we ever got to the situation. Uh, that we're in with having this much dirty laundry. So, uh, without any further ado, let's get started. So, just kinda <laughs> starting out. Um, we bought ourselves our own house back in uh, December of last year, actually. Um, whenever we graduated from high school, we both were kind of on our own after that. Like we had places we could come back to, but not to the extent that most people are, I guess. Um, and so we were kind of on our own and finding our own place and providing things for ourselves. And whenever we found our, our house, we were really excited about it, obviously. But um, it somebody had broken into it and stolen a lot of appliances and stuff. There wasn't a washer and dryer, a refrigerator, a stove, or like a toilet in the master bathroom. For the most part, we were able to kind of figure it out, have, uh, like my dad found a toilet for our bathroom and that kind of thing. But um, we weren't able immediately to get a washer and dryer, which was okay because uh, our, my aunt, we lived right next to her, and she told us like we could use her washer and dryer whenever we needed to and that sort of thing, so we weren't immediately worried about it. Uh, it was obviously something that we knew we needed to get, but we weren't killing ourselves to find one before we moved in. Um, well, after we moved in, we had a car and Tyler was going to work and that sort of thing and I really wanted to go to work but I couldn't find a job anywhere and we only had the one car so it was going to be like a really big deal for me to try to find a way to get to work and that sort of thing. Um, so we didn't have a ton of money and it was kind of everything that we could do to pay off our refrigerator and stove which we used uh, my aunt's Lowe's card for to like put it on credit so we could pay it off and we knew that we weren't going to be able to uh, use that card and have enough money to pay off the refrigerator and stove and a washer and dryer so we were still kind of out of a washer and dryer and while my aunt did say that you know we could use her washer and dryer whenever we needed to it, it doesn't really work out in reality it she was like wanting to wash our clothes and we never got them back and that sort of thing. It was just a bad situation. Um, and so we ended up never actually sending over a lot of our clothes to her. And that's how we got to this, uh, this mess. And uh, now that we're living with Krista and Josh, we do have a washer and dryer. We just, uh, haven't yet gone through them and washed them all and so that's kind of what's happening today um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and start a little montage so you guys don't have to sit through a real time of me sorting clothes and uh i'll see you guys in a minute finally done sorting them all we have an empty tote so now I'm gonna go throw some of these in the washer and kind of explain what we're gonna do with everything 
Okay, the first load is officially in the washer, so uh, I thought that I would share with you, like I said, about what is going to be happening with the clothes. Because, I don't know about you guys, but for me, the first thing I would have thought if I saw somebody with all those dirty clothes is, what have you been wearing? Um, and the answer to that is mostly new clothes. You see, a lot of those that are in, that were in that tote, um were clothes that we wore in high school but Tyler and me both kind of want to change our wardrobe to something that's a little bit more grown up I guess so um after all these clothes are washed we're gonna go through and really pick out what we still want out of all of these clothes and the rest we're gonna be donating to Goodwill or something like that so that's kind of where we are right now um I think Krista is going to be hopping in here a little bit later just to uh, show you her laundry and stuff. And yeah, so we'll see you in a little bit. Hey guys. Hey. So we're here with Penny on a completely different day. Yes. <laughs> and uh, we're about to finish up some laundry. We got not lazy yesterday. We did still do some laundry, but... Things got hectic, so we just didn't record it. <laughs> we got busy, we'll say. Yeah, so, um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and fold these. We're watching a movie, yep. so uh, we're gonna Christmas get it done. Movie. Yep, and it's 11.20 at night, so we'll see how long this takes us to do. Let's go ahead and just dump it. Let's go. Let it roll. Oh, Lord. Holy Jesus. <laughs> this is mine and Josh's laundry. All right, here we go. officially done it is 11 38 which means this video has been going for 20 minutes yes so it takes 20 minutes to fold one basket of laundry <laughs> we're gonna be honest we was watching the movie a lot more than we was focusing on folding these clothes and i was singing just a little and doing this thing and she doing can't that. dance don't worry about it i'm real bad at dancing there's a reason my husband and i didn't have a first dance <laughs> it just it had been real bad. Cause I don't dance. Josh don't dance. So yeah, we're gonna get these put up and then uh, see you guys in a minute. Hey guys. Hey. So we just wanted to pop in and say good night. It is twelve forty ish. No, twelve fifteen. I can't see. <laughs> uh, it's twelve fifteen, and we are going to edit and. Get this video uploaded for it you guys. already started right here yep. so please like and subscribe and hit the little notification bell if you want to know when we upload and all that good jazz and uh, we'll see you guys next time yeah. bye, bye.